happy sunday y'all today is sunday i wanted to start the day off by going to church today but yesterday the condition that i saw my lady in i just didn't feel like um i should not go there early right now it's 9 35 and i'm gonna get there for 10 a.m she called me earlier <laughs> But I just didn't feel like today was one of those days where I wanted to wait until 12 o'clock to get there. Because if I had gone to church, I would have gone to church at 10 o'clock and got there for 12. But I don't know. Ever since the day when she fell, I've just been like more keen, like paying more attention to her. And even before she fell, a couple of days before she fell or maybe a week before she fell, I remember I went there one morning and she was outside of the door. You know, when you come out of your door and you're locking it behind you that's where she was and i'm like yo where are you going i don't know what she was saying or whatever the case is but even that should have been alarming for me too but the day when she did fall um somebody from the agency was supposed to be there and nobody was there so that was a whole situation too because even when she was at the hospital the social the social work at the hospital you know wanted the number for the agency and stuff to figure out what was going on and best believe the next morning the agency made sure that somebody was out there even though they had reassured me that excuse me somebody would have been there that day when she fell you know so i'm gonna try and call the lady back tomorrow at the agency but um i'm i'm kind of going through it right now because i got my cycle and i i kid you not like it's it's just not that great this time around it's never great but this time it's not that great you know and so I'm just here, today is our um, breakfast date, but I can't even go inside of the place. And I mean, it's cold. Normally it's a place where you like eat outside and stuff like that when the weather is nice, but it's fairly cold. So we would have eaten in the car anyways, but I had to just tell Mr. to like order the food because I just feel like I have one more getting up and going outside of this car in me. And it's to do that when I get to Brooklyn. Like I can't, I can't do that right now. Not even for this food, so he went in there to order it. I really hope that the coffee is good. I told him to taste it when he's making it, but yeah. So I just decided that I'm not going to go to church, and he doesn't feel like going. I don't know if it's just that he doesn't feel like going without me, because he went without me the week before last week, or if he just doesn't feel like going in general, you know. Whatever it is, neither of us are going. But um, I'm going to try and see if I can work it out where I can get to go next week, because last week when I went to church, I really, really liked it. I enjoyed the church, and just everything that it embodies you know so that's great and i feel like it, it set me off right to like start the week and everything so that was good and i really liked that now we're getting breakfast and then we're gonna head to brooklyn it's pretty much the plan i'm gonna be there until probably like four o'clock or so so that's great all day <coughs> But I feel like it's very necessary. One of the reasons why I said I, I don't feel like today is one of those days where I don't want to be there early is because yesterday when I was there, um, periodically she would come outside of her room into the living room and she's like, um, I guess I'll go down now. You know, I feel like she's displaying either early stages of dementia or Alzheimer's. I don't really know which one it is. And I really thought that when she went into the emergency room, they would have at least kept her for 24 hours to like evaluate her and stuff and they really did not which was mind-blowing to me and then i'm waiting on the agency to send out a doctor for her because i want to ask him to like check for those things you know and i mean obviously he's a family doctor and this is what he does then maybe he'll be able to see those little signs like just from evaluating her without me even seeing anything but i do want to bring that up so that's one of the things that i definitely need to call the agency about tomorrow if the lady would just answer the phone and if i call tomorrow and she doesn't answer the phone i'm gonna ask to speak to like the manager or something because the last time i had to do that because i was calling and i wasn't getting through to her however every time she's calling me she gets me so i don't know but um that's what's going on and the coffee hopefully when i get this coffee instead of me then i will, I will start <laughs> well that sounds bad hopefully when i start drinking the coffee and my body starts processing it i start feeling a lot better but right now I feel like poop. So hopefully that's not the move for the day. 
all right y'all so we got some food in me and the mood is a little bit better you know we went from a 10 to like a maybe like a six for being completely honest but like um now we're headed towards her and it's cr it's a good thing that i decided against um going to church because i'm telling you she already called me three times i had like a croissant you know croissants are like flaky or whatever and then he bought like a is it an apple tart an apple something that was made from croissants as well so that was like falling all over the place i wouldn't be surprised if it was all on me but um yeah she already called me three times and i was very meticulous yesterday when i was leaving in terms of like i leave the regular stuff that i would leave on her nightstand and i still left something on top of the cupboard in the kitchen like um a little sandwich just in case she went in there she's calling me again hello hello i can't hear you she's gonna call me back but i left um a sandwich and like a banana out in there just in case she went in there for something additional to eat you know so i called her earlier and i asked her um if she was hungry i asked her if she ate everything that was on the nightstand she said no so i told her if she's hungry just eat something else from there and then i directed her towards the sandwich and stuff instead of the kitchen but i'm i'm on my way over there right now it's 10 18 and i'm gonna you know just go over there so she called me and asked me if i was coming and i told her yeah and so we're going but we stopped out here at a little y'all can't even see at a little 99 cent store is over here because i need one of those like little beach chairs because she was calling me again they don't have any beach chairs inside there <clears throat> that's what we were at this 99 cent store to buy one of those chairs that you know are more relaxed because the chairs inside of her apartment are so like you're sitting up like a security guard or something all day like so I want something that's a little bit more relaxed that I can lean back a little bit or whatever, but they don't have it because right now it's off season. So I have to buy one on Amazon for $40 and I was really trying to avoid that and see if they had at like the 99 cent store or whatever, but they don't. And we stopped at another one and they were saying that, you know, it's a seasonal item. So like once it starts warming up a little bit, then they will have it in stores. But right now they just don't. <sighs> so like Mr. Just said, I'm shit out of luck. Like, gotta either order it on Amazon or use the hard chairs that are there. Yesterday I ended up working something out where the chair wasn't so hard anymore, but it's still obviously not the softest. But we'll make it work, you know? It's alright. But um, yeah, we're headed over there right now because she just called me again. Probably can't find a sandwich in the kitchen, but um, I'm headed there. But yeah, the Sunday is off to a decent little start. I'm just going to be sitting all day. I gave her a shower yesterday, so I definitely know for sure she's not going to take on today because they're not like us. We're like, oh, you want to get up every day and shower? Absolutely not. She would go two weeks if you allowed her. So um, I guess I'll just make some food. Yesterday, I made a lot of like steamed vegetables for her and some chicken. I don't have to cook today, actually. I just need to warm something up when it's time for her to eat. So today should be a snow day. We've secured a beach chair right there in the blue. So hopefully I'm gonna have more comfortable days because honestly, I've been feeling like I'm a security guard. <laughs> Sitting up in there, the chair is hard, my back is hurting, everything is hurting, and today everything is already hurting. My entire hoo-ha feels like it's falling out on me. So just imagine the day I would have had had I not gotten this beach chair. Wow, thanks. Why you say it dry like that? Now because it's off season, we're not gonna get it. But when it's in season, it's gonna be more expensive. Well, at least we have a chair for when you take me to the beach. I can't wait to be able to go to the beach. You smell my mouth? Don't say no shit like that and get so <laughs> <laughs> I can't drink it right now. I gotta wait until my cup is empty. I said drink as if I'm gonna swallow it. But um I can't wait to go to the beach. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. What?